Welcome back. This is where we left things last time, where we had a basic game where we could walk around, but it's not very interactive. So we're going to start to add some code so that different things happen and we can manipulate our world a little bit. So I'm going to stop the game and show you how to do this. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to change the hallway. And at the moment, in the hallway, it says this is a long, thin hallway. So I'm going to cut that. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to change text to script. So a script is a small program. I'm going to add a new script here, and it gives me lots and lots of choices of what to add. And I'm going to run down to first time. And then I'm going to say add. So I've added here the first time, and it's got otherwise. So I can say add a new script, and I'm going to print a message. And then I'm going to say add. And in here, I'm going to say uh, you see a mysterious man dart out of the room and otherwise I'm not going to do anything so I'm going to add a script afterwards to print a message add and then in here I'm going to put this is a long thin hallway so what we're looking at is you've got the first script which runs depending of it's the first time in the room and then you've got a message which says this is a long thin hallway gets printed afterwards. Let's see this. So when I play, I'm going to be in the cell. When I go south, I'm going to come into the room for the first time. And it will say, you see a mysterious man dart out of the room. I go east in the throne room. And when I come back to the hallway, it doesn't mention the mysterious man. So our script is starting to change how our game works. Give it a go.